away that sand goes. Up come the drivers, and it's off to the races. 50-26, Iron Panthers drops a piece of cargo for the Red Alliance. 2907 of the Blue Alliance, Lion Robotics. Puts a, piece, puts a hatch panel on the cargo ship for the Blue. 3847 of the Blue Alliance Spectrum drops a piece of cargo into the cargo ship for the Blue Alliance. 1323 of the Red Alliance. Madtown Robotics placing hatch panels on the Red Rocket while their partner, 973 Graybots, begin to put cargo into both the rocket and the cargo ship for the Red Alliance. Red Alliance 5026, Iron Panther. Playing defense against 3847 Spectrum. Spectrum tries to get past them. They're successful. They get some cargo put into the cargo ship for the Blue Alliance. Lots of scoring fast. 77 seconds left to go in this match. And the Red Alliance is out in front by a score of 65 to 53. Red Alliance has filled up one Red Alliance rocket here on the scoring table side. Now 1323 Madtown Robotics runs back to the cargo ship in the center. Blue Alliance matches that by 3847 Spectrum, putting cargo into the cargo ship. 2907 Lion Robotics races back over. 3847, their partner Spectrum, trying to get past some defense being tossed at them by the Red Alliance. Red Line bots, 5026 almost goes over, jumping on top of a piece of cargo, then getting off. 32 seconds left to go in the match. Red Alliance out in front, 82 to 63. Up goes 5026 Iron Panthers to the third level. They're already in position for the end game. Both alliances continue to try to score. Here come the Rubble Wet Wranglers back across to the Blue Alliance end zone. 973 Graybots put up their big lifting mechanism. Tosses themselves up into the third platform. Seven seconds left. Robo Wranglers trying to get up. Five, four, three, two, and one. out of the sandstorm and in the end they couldn't just catch up uh, Carver with the wind 103 to 89 Hopper versus Turing Turing undefeated Turing undefeated another high score just amazing to see full cargo ship full rocket ship and that was Newton's